Hey guys, today I'm in the studio with the 2012 Kohler Wellworth Class 5. I bought this originally myself in 2012 with the redesigned tank. I do still have that tank, but it's in storage and I didn't want to go digging it out because it's pretty cold outside. So I just threw on this Ingenium tank from the one that I already had on this channel. And you'll see that the handle's a little bit weird because it's not actually attached. Now, people that have been subscribed for a long time will recognize this as the very first toilet that I ever uploaded to this channel way back in 2013. And there's the date. And I originally got it back in 2012 because I thought it was cool that they redesigned the tank, even though I do prefer this design. Let me take the lid off really quick. Now this would not be a true class five performance test if I just had a normal flapper in it. So I do have Kohler's Aqua Piston in there. And this is the same type of tank that would have came on a Wellworth Classic, which was the alternative to the redesigned one in 2012. I'm not sure if they still do that or not, but this tank would have the same amount of water um, as that one. And that one came with an Aqua Piston too. So this is equivalent to that. So this setup works. It's not like the tank's any taller and gonna add any pressure or anything. Um, you can see it is adjusted just a little bit above the water line. That's how I've been testing all of these toilets because it is possible to get one from the factory that's just a little bit too high. So I like to give the toilets a little bit of help there with just a tiny amount of extra water, but it, it really doesn't make a difference. And since the handle's a bit too long, I'm actually gonna be flushing this by hand. So I'm gonna remove that handle and I'm gonna flush them all like this. So yeah, pretty simple. There's not much to say about these toilets. There's actually a new version of the Class 5 out now with more of a square trapway. I don't really like those as much. I don't think the performance looks as good, but I've never tested one, so I don't know if that's true or not. Maybe one day I'll get one of those and I can throw it up on the stand and see how it compares to this and the other generations of Wellworths. But yeah, if you guys have any other questions, let me know in the comments down below and I'll see you guys in the next video.